ladies it's time to wake up there are simply not enough high caliber women in this world and you need to be one of them i'm going to be listing off seven things that are required absolutely required for you to be a high caliber woman and trust me when i say she gets pretty much everything that she wants in life in a world where it is so easy to say let everybody do what they want to do and don't be judgmental and you should not be categorizing people that is a very easy mindset to have to resist any change and to resist any growth you have to understand that if you decide to go with a certain path in life that is what you're going to get back so if you are not improving yourself especially in these areas that i'm going to talk about you will be the majority of percentage of people you're going to fit in in a herd of sheep and you're going to stay there I know it kind of is painful to hear, but that is the honest truth. And that is the point of this channel. I am making this channel about money, woman, and power. And my goal is to educate and guide you towards the direction of being the best version of yourself. My name is Karina, by the way. So you'll realize that most of these things most women do and you don't want to be the average low caliber woman you really don't you don't get as much attention you don't see as much success and you're just kind of slumping through life that's not what you want in your life is it probably not i want to let you know that i also wrote a guide to confidence essentially imagine walking into a room and sparkling with all eyes on you and feeling completely shameless about it that is what this book is all about you can get it down below in the description or go to intoamillilady.com slash confident so the seventh thing that a high caliber woman does is she never begs for attention now most people honestly do this most women do this they're always asking for attention whether it's with their appearance their voice literally sometimes even physically asking for it right a high caliber woman knows that she already has this attention and she's not going to be asking for it that is the true true confidence of somebody like that and you really need to work that out to know that no matter what everybody else is doing you are confident in yourself to not have to stoop to those low levels to get somebody's kind of peanut gallery attention is she does not beg for a man's attention and she does not do things for a man now obviously if you are in a committed relationship where the man is amazing of course it's a two-way street and you have your feminine side of things and contributions that are in for a relationship but what most ladies do is they literally leech onto a man who's not giving them attention he's not giving them the time of day they're not in a committed relationship he has not given any signs to make it seem like it's even going in that direction he's probably not returning text messages or phone calls instead of asking you to dinner he asks you for drinks and he's suspiciously following other ladies on Instagram, commenting on their photos. You will be amazed at how, at how many ladies swoon over this type of man. And they're willing to do so much for him. So just cancel plans, get ready last minute, or get ready fully, and have him cancel and still not be mad. They're willing to give away everything they have emotionally and physically to this man. And again, that's just highlighting of desperation. A high caliber woman would never do something like that. Number five is the way you dress. A high caliber woman knows what flatters her body, knows what body type she is, and know what clothes highlight her femininity and sexuality without stepping over to the provocative, sleazy, side of things. It's very easy, my ladies, and I want you to understand to say something like, stop slut shaming stop shaming women for how they dress they should be able to wear whatever they want and i totally agree it's your life and it's your choice i understand we're not living in caveman times but i want you to also understand the mentality of it and the truth is you will be getting certain perceptions about you by your appearance how you look how you dress how you act 
all of that is a language and if you are choosing a certain route for yourself you have to understand what comes with that if you choose to dress in a certain way you realize that yes you might get more attention but is this the type of attention that you want again it's your life but you have to decide what standards you want to have in it and by choosing a dress style that is provocative sleazy gives you that kind of negative attention you're really not attracting the highest quality and again is that something you really want four is a high caliber woman is always learning and always improving herself in all areas of life which is education her fitness journey her appearance she understands that time gives wisdom and new opportunities so she will take every possible advantage of those things right time is not something that you just sit around and watch tv all day there's so many hidden opportunities and even obvious opportunities every single day that you must capitalize on there is ways that you can make more financial income there's ways that you can enhance your appearance there's ways you can enhance your health and when you have that hunger when you have that strive when you know your vision and goals and you are going for that you are a high caliber woman and again this is the minority of people so you have to understand when you are in a circle of people or perhaps meeting a suitor this will really make you stand out because the majority of people are letting life happen to them instead of literally doing life which is what a high caliber woman does always knows her worth Again, that applies to relationships, it applies to work settings, it applies with spending time with friends and taking on other projects. She knows what her skills and assets are, what she can actually positively contribute in a certain project or in a certain relationship, and she plays up those factors, right? You're not gonna say yes to something that you know you're not gonna add value in because you're wasting your own time and you're wasting someone else's time. And this really applies to everything. You're, if you're a high caliber woman, you're not going to participate in a romantic relationship with somebody who does not appreciate your worth. That's where a high caliber woman will cut the string because she has no obligation to stay in those and they're just again depleting her time, depleting her energy and ladies. That's not good for your skin. It's not good for the glow in your eyes to be depleted this way. So please realize this, that how much you're worth. A high caliber woman also doesn't let others disrespect her. This applies to everything and anywhere. And I think you understand the point. A high caliber woman will stand her ground and she will defend herself. And the number one thing, the number one thing, ladies, she does not care what others think. She's not doing things for other people. She's doing things for herself. And whatever she puts out there, she doesn't care what others' opinions are. If they think she is not gonna make it, if they think she is, you know, <laughs> doing something that most people aren't doing. Because to get what others don't have, you have to do what others are not willing to do. And most people don't wanna do that. So what do they do? They judge, they start judging, the rest of the women who are actually trying to make an impact, trying to make a difference. And a woman like that knows that she's gonna run into a lot of hate. So for that reason, she doesn't let any of that get to her and she knows her mission and she's gonna keep moving forward no matter what. So that is it for the seven things check out my confidence ebook guide down below into amelielady.com confidence subscribe to the channel like the video and i will see you in the next one